I'm walking down this neighborhood trying to see if I can get some goodies. Super green blocky. I'm gonna check out this rooftop restaurant here in Manizales. Let's go check it out. See? Can be in Manizales or no? Mm. This is real. Meat in your state. Hey, yeah, it's me green. Too, me too. Well, hello, viewer. You're probably wondering who this woman is and what does she have to do with Senor Nate in this video? Well, I'll give you some spoilers. She's taking me to a lot of food spots. Which spots does she recommend, you ask? Well, you're going to have to watch for that answer. Now, let's continue with this video. Hey, uh, gringa. <laughs> oh, aquí? Okay. I was taken to the spot called Sushi Time, which is located in the eastern part of Manizales in the neighborhood called Cable, or Cable. It started off with some mango viche and limonada de coco. She ordered this habichi bowl that came with a variety of mixed meats. Gracias. <laughs> Seriously, over this bowl of stir-fried rice, we got ham, chicken, and beef. Come. Mmm, go ahead. But I got so excited that my food came, this is what happened. Me gusta. Okay. Oh no! Lo siento! <laughs> no, estoy muy emocionado. Oh, lo siento, lo siento. No problem. <laughs> oh no, look what happened. I got too excited that my food came. You know I love food. I really love food. And my food came. The waiter is bringing my food. And I got so excited, I knocked this down. Yo, I may be Nate the Great, but I'm still clumsy from time to time. Oh my gosh. Oh man, go ahead. No me parece gracioso para nada. Okay, I'm so. Okay. No, it's funny. Okay. Speak for the Ooh, world. Oh. And guys, I'm very playful too. You're acting childish. So after eating some bomb sushi, we decided to take a taxi halfway through town where we decided to actually continue on foot. She wanted to show me more about her city, and on top of that, Manizales is a city built on the hills. La ciudad de la montaña. Si? Oh, si, Get out of here. ain't no New York City. Get out. What? Despite looking at the map and how things do tend to seem far away, it isn't that bad. We did walk all the way from Avenida Santander to El Central, where she revealed this. Sorry, but I No, now. Always. She's basically communicating that she feels some type of way concerning Venezuelans and that she hasn't always felt this way towards them. Mm -hmm. mm. But on top of that, reassuring that Manizales is indeed a safe city. Moving along, let's just talk about this rooftop restaurant right there on Plaza de Boulevard. Words cannot explain how much I fell in love with this restaurant, from the service, to the food, to the drinks, everything was good the bathrooms were clean they were respectful they took care of us man and it's to the point that i know for sure anytime nate comes back to manizales i'm always going to make it a mission to come back to this spot i know one thing i'm going to try in the future is to visit this place in the evening because it already has nice views so i'm trying to figure out how the city will look like when it's like dusk coming towards nighttime Yuka chips. No, it's Papa. No, it's Papa. It's Yuka. It's Yuka. It's Yuka. I know. Ooh, look at that. Here we go. We got like shrimp, avocado, toasted onions at the top. And I think tomato. A cold dish. Different. But it's not bad. Not a bad appetizer. We got ourselves some mushroom soup and some olive oil and bread to go with it. 
Got some cheese on top. And there goes the mushrooms. You don't understand. This mushroom soup is slamming. It's a creamy mushroom soup. Muchas gracias. I smell a lot of butter, butter parmesan cheese, which is in there for sure. Too. It's definitely a fresh, fatty salmon. They didn't put salt on it, but it's refreshing. It doesn't have a strong aftertaste either. I can definitely rock with this. Because most of the food in Colombia definitely have like a strange aftertaste. But this I can definitely rock with because it's not noticeable at all. As far as the fettuccine goes, you can taste the salt in that. Wow. You can definitely really taste the salt in the fettuccine. Salt and cheese, but it's super creamy. Now that's cheesy. And you? Muy bueno. Muy bueno. No. Si. 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 Hey. How is it? All right, y'all, if you made it this far into this video, I want you to give yourself a like because you are awesome people and I know you guys could be doing anything else besides watching Elsa and your Nate. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button too so that way you get updated whenever Elsa and your Nate has more videos. Moving along, we're now taking cable cars south of Manizales into Villa Maria which is a town and municipality in the Colombian department of Caldas. It does have a family-friendly vibe, and I recommend that other travelers stop by whenever you visit Manizales. There was a shop that she wanted to show me nearby, so we just headed up the block to this bakery, and everything looked good. Wait. Okay. So that's it. Okay. Okay, she recommended this to me, so I'm about to try this out. Como se llama? Postre tiramisu. Si te gusta. En serio. Mm. This right here? Dos mil. Actually, I meant it's moreno. <laughs> it's moreno. Si, si. Es... Yo lo veo pink. I know, but pero es brown. Marro. Marron, es marron. Yo no sé. It, it look pink, si, pero es marron. No, es marron, es pink. <laughs> All right, yeah, let me add a little context, all right? So I do some filming with my phone, all right? To do this video, I'm using my Galaxy Note 20. Unfortunately, my phone looks pink, but it's a brown phone. It's the Mystic Bronze. Nevertheless, we're on our way to the mall. She wanted to show me one of the malls here. It's the Exito Mall here in Manizales, and it's a pretty big mall. In fact, I believe it's one of the biggest malls in Manizales, and it's north from Plaza de Boulevard. From visiting this mall, she then recommended that I go and visit the other malls. As you've seen in my previous video, you've seen a video with me in the mall, and you're going to see future videos of me checking out malls because, hey, I think it's a good idea since I am a foreigner and I want to see what you guys got. Mm. Ice cream? Ice cream? Si. Helados. Pero en Colombia dicen. Is this an alada or, or crema? Crema. Si? Mm. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mucha gente. Um, mucha gente, mucha lugares. Me conozco ya tu ciudad. Eh, soy colombiano. Por qué? la verdad. No tengo novia. You think? See? I had a good day overall, man. She got some good recommendations. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe if you find value out of this video. And if you want to see another video of me checking out malls and Manizales, go ahead and click over here.